Welcome to this Flip Dish tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how you can manage your order capacity. This will allow you to limit the number of orders your store can accept during a particular time of day. We are delighted to show you this piece of functionality as it's something we know will really benefit your business and allow you to make real-time decisions to manage how many orders you receive. I will show you how to set this up and show you what it looks like for your customers on your restaurant's website. I'm going to set up capacity limits for our test restaurant, Pizza Cafe Ireland. So on the Flipdish portal homepage, I can scroll down to the store I want to set up limits for, and then click on the cog wheel above the sales graph to edit the store's settings. I then scroll down to pre-order settings. You can choose between collection and delivery limits. The reason we give you the option to choose between these two is because limiting orders isn't always related to how many orders your kitchen can prepare. It may also relate to not having enough drivers to deliver those orders during different times of the day. I'm going to click delivery. So the times you can select are based off the intervals you have already selected for your customers to be able to order between. So I have an interval of 10 minutes and down the bottom of the page, I am displaying single time meaning your customer can just see the start of the interval when selecting on the website, like you can see here. So I'm going to set up some limits for today. First I click on the calendar, then I select the time that I want the limit to start at and the finish time. And for the purpose of this demonstration, I'm going to select one order per 10 minute interval. This means my restaurant will only be able to accept one order in each 10 minute interval. So to finish, I click create, and as you can see, a block appears in the calendar. Now this change isn't live yet on your site, as I have to click save at the bottom of the page to activate this change. So let's click save, and now let's go to our online restaurant and see what that looks like. So let's place an order for delivery. As you can see, the order went through as normal. Now that this order has been placed, let me try again and see if I can place another order within the same interval. As you can see, when I go to select a time interval, it is now greyed out and it says full beside it. We are currently counting pending orders at the moment, so even if you haven't accepted the order, if a second customer tries to order in that interval, the system will not allow it. So let me show you how intuitive this piece of functionality is. So if I change my intervals for customers to order to 20 minutes from 10 minutes, you will now see that the amount of orders that I can accept during that time doubles as well. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video on how to manage your order capacity. If you have further questions, just email help at flipdish.com.